everyone, today I'm going to show you how I clean all of my makeup brushes. My face is super sensitive, so if I use a dirty makeup brush, my face will break out like crazy. So I have to always make sure to always clean my brushes. There are two different ways that I clean my makeup brushes. The first one is my daily spot cleaning and the second one is my weekly deep cleaning. So let's get started. First, I'm going to show you how I spot clean my brushes. Spot cleaning is whenever you use a brush cleanser like this from MAC, my all-time favorite, to quickly wash your brushes. I spot clean my brushes whenever I want to use a different shadow, but with the same brush, it dries super quick, like 10 to 15 seconds. So all you need is a paper towel, and I'm just going to pour some. You have to be very careful because it just pours out. So I just do this. You do it by the shape of your brush. Since this is a flat brush, I'm going to just go back and forth. And it's clean. I'm just going to set it aside. This is also a flat brush, so I'm just going to go back and forth. I always spot clean my eyeliner pencil because I always use gel eyeliner which gets hard if you don't wash it. And then for round brushes, you have to swirl it like this in a circular motion. So the brushes are already dry. I like to spot clean my eye makeup brushes every day. Now I'm going to show you how I deep clean my makeup brushes. As you can see, they're very, very dirty. I've been using my Sephora makeup brush shampoo and I'm almost running out. And I was thinking, why should I go buy another shampoo if I could use things that I have in the house? So on a plate like this, I, using my Japanese cherry blossom that I got from Bath & Body Works, this is an antibacterial gentle forming hand soap. You can also use an antibacterial dishwashing soap, but I prefer this one because it's more gentle, it's very moisturizing. This hand soap is enriched with an exclusive blend of moisturizing honey, coconut milk, and olive fruit extracts to help nourish and soften the skin. So it's a lot more gentle on my makeup brushes and it doesn't dry it out. This is an antibacterial soap so it will kill all the bacteria and dirt that are caught inside this brush. I'm going to leave a paper towel aside so that I can place my clean brushes on it. So I'm going to pump a little bit onto this plate. And then using my extra virgin olive oil, I'm also going to apply a little bit of that in here. The olive oil will help condition your brushes. Just going to mix it, make sure that your hands are clean. Using lukewarm water, I'm going to wet the bristles. Make sure you always hold your brush facing downward so the water doesn't get into here where the glue holds all of it together. Put some on the palms of my hand and then just swirl it around creating a nice lather. As you can see, it's all falling out. I'm going to squeeze the excess water out. And now my brushes are all clean. When the bristles get wet, the tip of this brush looks more darker. I've seen a lot of people just swirl their brushes around onto the plate and just repeating that with all of their makeup brushes. But I personally don't like doing that because I feel like my brushes don't get that clean because the soap is already all dirty in here. To dry my brushes, I use my paper towel, lay it down flat, and then using a pen or a sharpie, I roll it around the napkin once and then lean my brush. 
on there. That way all the water will fall down onto the napkin. It takes a few hours for it to dry so I suggest that you wash your brushes on the day that you know you won't be using them. So that was all. I hope you guys enjoyed this video and got some ideas on how you can clean your makeup brushes. For more videos, subscribe to Beautify Me, like and comment down below, and I'll talk to you guys later. Bye!